Hallelujah. Amen. The other topic. Suit them. I increase the speed of the language. Vitesse ya ruga. No, not ruga. The speed of the language. Or oh, in French, la vitesse du langage. Vitesse ya usemi. Hallelujah. Amen. I am talking. The topic is the wave's dimension. Dimension des ondes. Now, the under topic. I take Nabeba, the speed of the language vitesse ya usemi. into the life Mumaisha. and into this dimension of waves. If you want to succeed on the earth, you must know first of all how to access in the dimension of waves. Now, into the dimension of waves, there are what you must learn, what we are calling the speed of language. I have spoken this, that into waves dimensions, we are in need of three things. The transmitter, emitter, the receiver, and frequency. Now, those three things for capturing the network. It is capturing the network of the speech ya misemo of the speech ya usemi now today Asa i want to increase on the speed of the language vitesse ya usemi your language usemi wako has got a speed inekaraka na vitesse how to calculate unaweza calculate the speed of your language. Now, when you will know to calculate the speed of your language, you can know even how to calculate the speed of God's language. Say you to the speed of the language. Even in English, the speed of the language. The speed of the language. God created everything through her language. A language has got all paragons into the language. There are all kinds of systems. For realizing whatever people are in need of. Through your way of speaking, you can realize what you are looking for. The reason we speak on the speed of the language. God, after all creating, the Bible into Genesis. Chapter number 2. Chapter number 2. Verse 19. He's speaking what? After God or creating. Out of the ground. Out of the ground. Kudongo. Kudongo. Out of the ground, he created all pieces, trees, and whatever. And he took that ground and go with it to Adam. After having to Adam, he put it 
before Adam. His own secret. He had known that out of it. No. I've created everything. Now, the speed of the language of the man can visualize what I've eaten out of the ground. The reason he took the ground and he go with it to Adam to see how how Jay, how he will call them. A mother you are. God after all creating. Out of the ground. He created everything. And he hid there. Only there. After he hiding. He took the ground. It became as a virgin ground. And go with it to Adam. The Bible is being watched. When he has gone with it to Adam, it was to see how he will call them. Mami, you, you can read even Bemba there. Verse 19. Verse 19. The speed of the language. Amen. Awe, ye ovalesa, abumbile, kumushidi, inamayonse, iampanga, ne chuni chonse, ichamulwelele, no kutuala kumuntu, Kukumona icho wena enga finika. Ah, yes. They are in this way. I've got it. Read it. Genèse chapitre 2, verset 19. Nous lisons au nom de Jésus Christ. Amen. L'éternel Dieu forma de la terre tous les animaux des champs et tous les oiseaux du ciel. Et il les fit venir vers l'homme pour voir comment il les appellerait et afin que tout être vivant porte le nom que lui donnerait l'homme. Ah, yes. God after all creating. Out of the ground. Yes. Out of the ground. He took the ground on the shoulders and go with it to the man. After arriving with it to the man, Moses is being what? It was foreseen. Are we together? Foreseen how he will call them. When they are calling something, it, to us, it is not for seeing. To us, to us, it is for hearing. When they are calling, you must hear. Are we together? If they call, it is not so that you see. No, it is for hearing. I say, Pastor Muzala. That means it is to him not to see, him to hear. Now here they are speaking. God him took whatever has created after adding it round the soil. And he took the soil and he go with it before Adam to see how he will call them. What it means? To see how we will visualize them. What system the man will use. This is what they say. He has God to see how he will call him. What it means? To see what system the man will use for visualizing what I've written here. 
Alleluia. Amen. Alleluia. Amen. And you too, God has already created whatever you are looking for. Whatever you, you've came here to look for, God has already created it for you. Now the problem, he has already brought it to you. Near of you, now he stand up aloof. And then he started to wait to see how, what means, what you will do for visualizing what he has created for you. It is not for God to visualize what he has created for us. No, God has created the children. And he had already brought it near of you. Now he is waiting to see what paragon you will use for visualizing those children whom he had brought. It is not for him to visualize them. It's for you. Money. Go, money. God has already brought it to you. Whatever you are looking for, he had already brought it for you. Now the problem is what? You must know how you will visualize them. God transported the soil. That is soil. If it was you, you can say it is the the vacuum soil. Feet. And he brought it to him. God can't bring something what is vacuum to you. Whatever God is transporting into the hand is not empty. The mic of God can't be empty. Whatever God is transporting, even a small bag of cards, the small bag, of God, can't be empty. This is the reason those people who killed Jesus, they knew that whatever belongs to him are useful. They tell me the underwear. They say, no, cut for me the patch so that I go to put into my house. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. They take it they start to struggle because of the underwear. Cut for me, cut for me, cut for me. They cut it in four parts. And so that they start to jump for taking even a small part of it. It is to say, even the underwear of Jesus was not empty. Hallelujah. Let I tell you, everything what God can bring to you, don't think that it's empty. No. Any words, any preaching, what God is giving you is not empty. The advice of God won't be empty. Hallelujah. Amen. But if you bring it to you, you will see it as uh, it is a forever game. But enter in it. Find the methods. 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 What you can use for discovering what is there inside. If we bring to you the water, you can say, ah, the water is a vacuum. But if you find the methods for using that water, you will find that no, the water is no vacuum. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. After all creating, he had hidden the heat into the soil. And then he took now the soil and he go with it to the man. After putting it before the man, he turned aloof to see how the man will visualize what is into the soil. And the man remained there. The secret of God, there was no way to access because there was a stumbling block. 
Now, the man wants to use the speed of his language. It was to the man to increase the speed and to learn the speed of his language. Your language, when you are speaking, has got a level of a speed. It is going into a certain dimension for reaching the dimension of words and it is that to create. When the man stand up like this, after knowing that my father to me want to transport a vacuum thing, it is to say here, into the ground what he brought before me, they are hidden things. Director, he used the language. He start to use the language. When he was using the language, whatever he was speaking was happening. Was happening. If it happened, him, son, him. That who you happen, you are lion. Again, he uses the speed of a language. When the language will go, directly, one thing will be visualized. He say, you, you are leopard. And he, he speak again. He say, you, you are a snake. Do you know? He was uh, naming them through the system of the speech. If you speak that, a crippling thing must happen here and it will have a poison into the mouth. Directly, they saw a snake happen. He said, you are a snake, you. And you will have a what? It is to say, his language has got a speed and because of the speed, it was realizing things. Your words, one day, will become your reality. Hallelujah. Amen. Let us tell you. Your ways one day will become your reality. If your mother or your father was only insulting you, you are you are a prostitute. You are a prostitute. That speed of that language, one day it will create what your mother had spoken. You will stand, you become what your mother was speaking. You become a prostitute because of what that system had created into the waves dimensions. I, I am a sufferer. I am a sufferer. As you are speaking, you must know that your language has got the speed to access even into the enemy camp. As you are speaking, I am a sufferer. I am a sufferer. Directly, you will see your, your speech will go into the enemy's camp. After arriving to the enemy's camp, and the enemy will discover what you are speaking. Into proverb. They are speaking what? Chapter number six. My child, you was narrated through the speech of your ways, the word of your mouth, through your way of speaking, therefore, has got you. The reason you see, you are caught. Now, remember what you can do for changing the system of your language. You are not having because yourself, you are programming to know how. Through your speech, you program I won't have. Into my life, I don't know if I can have. And you will see, you won't have. You are a witch of your life, of your body, because of your system of speaking, your language is no good. In the gems, chapter number three, verse one, there they are speaking what? My children, oh my brethren, we must not be more of masters. Because we shall receive a greater condemnation. 
through our language the way we are speaking before the people we shall receive a great condemnation as you are teaching the people it is what you do you must be because of what it is the system of your language your language has got a speed your language is not remaining where you are your language is going far is running as fast as your body can't run now when you are speaking you must control your speech what kind of speech are you using into the world and into the day Say this, uh, the speed of the language. God can speak one thing today, but it will come to your realize after this. And you too, you can speak one thing today, but it will come to take place into the future. After you forgot him. Do you speak what? God has spoken. It is not good. The man. To remain alone. I will make for him an helper. And. Before he made for him the helper. But he had transported first the soil. And bring it to him. So that him. Visualize whatever. Is there. After him visualizing, and God now bring him to a sleep. After bringing him to the sleep, he slept very bad. And God removed the rib of his body and go with it far and fall the woman. After forming the human, you bring him to the man again. As he has brought things what was into the ground, the same, he bring again the woman to the man to see how he will call him. Hallelujah. Are we together? Are we together? He formed everything and bring it to the man to see how man will visualize it. And after forming the woman, he had brought him again to the man to see how the man will call him. Now God was there waiting for the call. The way the man will call that woman. The language what will use. It is what will keep the woman into life. If the man miss words, at the time of calling the woman, according to the system, what? Uh, how it was, the man could not remain, the woman could not remain in life. God bring him to the man. And God turned aloof. Started to wait to see how the man will call him. The man will stand up and watch another human being before him. What he has never seen, what I have never even learned, at the videos, even in his story, there was no to eat. And uh, he didn't even know it. But he saw. Because he was very clever. The one who knew to who knew to control the language. After watching at the woman like this, he said, ah, this is now the woman. And they say what? Bones of my bones. Mufupa. Mufupa. 
bone of my bones. The way it started. Are we together? When they removed him, the rib. Was him seen? Did him understand? Did him feel pain? When God brings the woman unto him, he discovers her. No. This, this is not another thing. And he starts exactly, exactly with the bone. The first prophecy, he did to say, God was in the need to demand to prophesy on what he has created. Discover it. What is this? Are you a prophet? Hallelujah. Amen. God come and start to test him. If you are true a prophet, you will discover what is before you. He stand up like this, Adam, the first prophet of the universe. And I start to speak what? No. Into the realm of the spirit. I see. This is the bone of my bones. And I, uh, the exactly prophecy. A bone of my bones. What means? God took one reed. Only one rib. It was one bone. And him too, in his prophecy, he said, You are the bone of my bones. And I increase you of the flesh of my flesh. Because him was for soil. And the woman too come from soil. He said, and even the flesh, you are flesh of my flesh. Now you, you will be called a woman. Because you are coming from the man. You are coming from me. You are not, not, I can't give you another name. As I, I am man. You will become woman. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. In English, it's very nice. As I am a man, you will become woman. Okay. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Directly, God was somewhere. And I started to watch and I'm waiting now for the language. Speak one language as a condition of your life. In prison, you say, You are coming from me. I am a man. You, you will be called woman. Now, the condition, the man, it is the I. I will leave my father, my mother, and I will come to initiate to the woman. You are you. Because of what uh, you, you are coming from me. I must look for you. And I go into the realm of the spirit. He slaps. He slaps and says, yes, you are a nice prophet. And God has departed from there. And go. And go. Directly, the universe remains. Say the speed of the language. You are not good speaking. You are not good having. You are good speaking. You will good have. Every day into your life, prophesy good things. Whatever you are speaking is what will become. Even today, they are speaking what? Who has got women? Banamuke. Has got even men. Six women. Banamuke six. Into your house. You must know that you've got six men. 
Don't cry. Oh, God has not given me men. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Who has got men? His brother Johnny. He's not yours, mommy. This is for. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Oh, boys. You've got. Are not yours. Are for. You are keeping for. Hallelujah. You see today how our mama is there. This man is not even interested to her mommy. He's interested to her. <laughs> Hallelujah. And she too. She has got a girl. That girl, the man who came to marry that girl, is his. You will see that man will be interested only to the man. Because what? It is the law. What he has given himself, Adam, the first creator. Now, you must control the speed of your language. Whatever you are speaking is what will become. If you say, it will become as you've spoken. Pay attention. Now, control the speech of your, your, your language. Every day, you are speaking only good things. I am good. The life is okay. I too, I am a boss. Don't say, I, I came to escort others. No, no, no. No, that will be only escorting. You if you've spoken such words for your children, for yourself, you must repent because what, this is the reason you see your direction is wrong. At this time, you are suffering because of what you are no at the position of God, you are at the position of your language. I am the pastor. If I say, ah, I don't know if this church will go before. It won't go before. Because of what? Whatever I am speaking must be that uh, what I am speaking. If, I, if you, you believe in me to be your pastor, I am your pastor. But every day I start to sit, I am in sorrow, I am speaking. Uh, I don't believe that one. Uh, that one. Know that it is true because your all confidence is in me. As you put your all confidence in me, but I remain a sorrowful for you. You must know that your life is destroyed. The house may be good inside, but if the door is bad, even the house will be bad same. We are entering by the door for going to the life. Now, if the door is no good, the inside will be bad. The speed of the language. I must not go far because the atmosphere is no good. Every day I've got all the good news. The good thing so to speak to people. Now the problem is all the time, atmosphere. If I say don't sing so that I preach, oh, don't sing this and that. But if we say sing, we will see you take all the time. <laughs> Is it true, my pastor? Yes. Uh -huh. Yes. 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 Controlling your system of speaking. What, what may fault? fault? Are you using into your speech? Mm -hmm. 
Be careful. Be prudish. Even if you are very hungry, don't mistake in your speech. No. Be angry, it is good. But control your speech. There are no advantage when you are mixed if you speak. When you are very mixed after just speaking, the speech can't be recovered. Can't be recovered. Can't be recuperated. Am I talking to you? The speech is never recuperated. I recuperate you. If you speak, Come on, it is gone, it has gone. When Jesus was miffed, after being miffed, he was being a What happened? God destroyed the veil of the temple. God had changed the program. He made those people who were not at the time of resurrecting. Stones and stones they passed. And the translation and rotation stand up at the same time. Midnight become at midday. At the same time, three hours. When you are miffed, you are very angry. If you speak, the speech is never recuperated. The reason, when you become into sorrow, don't speak. When you are angry, more anxiety, don't speak. Because whatever you will speak into anxiety moment is never recuperated. Don't insult your child when you are in anxious. Because you want to recuperate whatever you have spoken. Don't speak any words when you are in anxious. You want to recuperate it. Be prudish. Prepare yourself when you are living. Be very prudish. The speed of the language. It is destroying the dimensions of once spoken, the word will go fast to the frequency. And then once the word into the frequency is recuperated less, there no way. Yes, this one is shooting us and we are speaking. I can't grab the word if I have spoken. It has already gone. And it is gone. In years of many. It has already gone. Don't speak when you are in anxious. Don't speak. Close your mouth. Don't express. Don't explain. When you are in anxious. Don't take decisions in a you, but not open your mouth to speak what you are planning when you are in anxious. No. 
Take it. It is good. But don't speak. When the anxious will go over, direct now, speak whatever you want. And you will see, you will correct the speech. You will correct, sir. This is not unspeakable. But if you are in anxious, you won't know what are unspeakable. Whoever who is accustomed to speak a lot when he is, he is not controlling his states, he is entering in sin. And after entering in sin, the result of the sin is the death. It is to say you will see your career going down, your marriage down, everything down, your neighbor hates you, every people start to avoid you now. Because of what? They say no, you are bad speaking. Never speak when you are anxious. Laugh the time of anxious. Speak the time of joy. When you are glad, and if you start to speak, you will see, you will see all your speech will be corrected. You are speaking all the nice things. Mothers, fathers, ladies and gentlemen, let her tell you. Into the law of nature, there are things what we must follow. A child. We are starting with a child. A child, even the human being, has got three steps. Three steps. Etape. The first step, it is a step from zero here. De zero to three years. The second state is starting from three years to 15 years. The last state is at 18 years. Going The first state, it is a state of three years. Starting on zero, arriving on three years, we are forcing a child to speak. Starting on zero, three to three years, we start to force him. You must speak, 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 speak. Papa, Mama, Dada, this and that. John, Peter, this one. We are forcing the child to speak. This is the law of every father. From zero to three years, it is a time to force the child to speak. Whatever I will speak, we are laughing. Even if he insults, you will laugh. Because what? He is into the moment where we are forcing him to speak. They are not seeing what is controlled. From three years to 15 years, we start to force the child to sit quiet. He wants to speak this. Tetoa. See, Cyrus. Fifteen years. You are forcing him to sit quiet. Three years. You force him to speak. Speak. This daddy, mommy, father, this and that. Say Catholic. Say this and that. But in three years old, 
They are forcing people to speak in three years. That means few years. Speak. But after three years, from three to eighteen, that means fifteen years, we force him to sit quiet, to sit silent, no speak. Fifteen years. What means? Multiply three years by five. They are forcing a person to sit quiet, not to speak. A child doesn't need to speak this quiet and we beat you. But you are forcing him to speak. He start to speak, but you start to force him. Don't speak. Don't speak. Sit silent. Because of what? You must learn the way you are speaking. 18 years of tuition to sit quiet, to control the system of the language. You want to speak. You don't know that your language has got a speed. In 15 years, the child is not speaking. Arriving now at 18 years, we let him free. Do now whatever you want. Himself will start to speak. Himself will start to do whatever he wants. Whatever he's in need of, he's speaking, he's doing whatever. But the problem is what? In 15 years, he had been trained to control his method of language. But to teach him to, to speak, it was three years only. It is to say, we can't teach it. You, 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 you are not to speak a lot. But 15 years, they train you to sit quiet. What means? Eh, into the life, you must have the mouth closed. Have you got a child of 18 years? Brother Joseph, have you got a child of 18 years? Brother Joseph, you are training them, training them to, to speak. If they insult, you laugh. You say, ah, he started to know. There will be a certain time. You will take now this, this mic. You are speaking, you are not. You are speaking. You are speaking. You are speaking. And you beat. Come here. You are speaking. You are speaking. You are speaking. For 15 years, you will be only smiting. So that a child led you to speak. After a time, you let him free now. Let go now. He will go with the school. Three years, they trained me to speak. Fifteen years, they trained me to sit quiet. What means? I must not speak a lot. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Am I talking to you? Is, uh, is, uh, but the speech is good now, the time is very bad. Don't have the time. 